are you? I'm fine, and you? I'm good. What is your name? Eden. Eden, how are you? I'm okay. How are you? I need Arlene, Arlene need to pray with you. Are you going to be in Joburg? Are you going to be in Joburg on Sunday? No. You are, you are traveling on Sunday. Yes, I'm okay. Trying. I want you to. I want you to get. I want you to get um, the material from the church yourself today. Yes. I want you to get it. I need to pray with you. Yes. Because you are crying. You are crying. You are complaining so much about your business. You yes. say you put money. You can't see the money. Now you are, you are saying, oh, why, why, why did I do this? If I know, I wouldn't have gotten into this business if I know. But God has opened the door for you. It's just yeah. a question, you know, when you want to do something, you consult God, then you start. But as you have started, the mistake is over. The sins are forgiven. God now will restore you. Amen. You cannot do business. You cannot do things and cry. You cannot do things and cry. No. Okay. Any wrong money, anything that is wrong, God have restored you. God have Amen. restored you. And from now, the business will open in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Don't regret it. It's not a mistake. Don't regret it, okay? God love you. The only thing is that we made a mistake. If we have prayed before we start, we wouldn't be getting stuck. But now, the door is open. Amen. Your sins are forgiven. In the Amen. name of Jesus Christ. Amen. And uh, I can see you are complaining of debt. You complain of debt. You know? You complain of owing someone or someone owing you. You are thinking about that debt. You understand? So, but the Lord, the Lord, the Lord has taken it out. You are going to have the money. Amen. So don't, don't cry anymore. Amen. Don't cry anymore. And someone wants to come in to partner with you. Someone wants to put money in what you are doing. Someone was trying to put money. Relax. Don't take any money now. Let us pray. Okay? Amen. Don't take any money. I want to see you between now and the January 1st, if it's possible. If it's possible, I want to talk to you one-on-one. -on -one. I really want to touch you. Yes. Okay? So yes. you try between now and uh, January 2nd. Let me just, Let me put it that way. Between on Sunday and January 2nd, I want to see you. I really want to see you. So try as much as you can. If you travel, come back. I need to talk to you. Okay? Yes. I want you to be happy to, to work hard so that people can benefit from you, from you. You have been benefiting from people. It is time for your family to benefit. It is now for your people to benefit. It is now for other people to eat from you. Okay? Yes. It is now. It is time. And Amen. any problem, God has canceled it. Anyone that will come to make a case with you, anyone that will come to make a case, I don't know what this case is all about, but we need to cancel it, okay? Amen. We need to cancel it. What is happening in your business? I'm just struggling to get contracts. You tr struggle to get contract. The contract will come. Amen. The contract will come. The Lord has opened the door. Amen. Okay? Amen. The, the Lord has opened the door. But be very careful. Don't partner with nobody until you pray very well. Okay? Amen. Don't, don't get into partnership now. Because when you get into partnership, it's going to be a problem. Don't do that. We need to pray. After prayer, the Lord has opened your door. You're going to get a lot of business. Don't worry about business. The Lord will do it. The only thing you have to do is just to pay tight. And tell God, I trust you, and I stand you as you stand for me. Any business I do, I will appreciate you. And at this business, I will help others. I will help people. I will help family. When you begin to have that in mind, God will have you at home. Okay? And God Amen. will open the door for you. Amen. Okay? Amen. So it is it is it is well with you. Amen. It's well with you. Lay your hand on your head like this. Put your hand like this. Father, in the name of Jesus Christ. Lord, I stretch my hands upon your son. Be free in the name of Jesus Christ. Father, I release wisdom upon him. Wisdom. Receive wisdom right now. You can never make mistake. You can never make mistake. I can't see any mistake in your life. I redirect your part. Receive it in the name of Jesus Christ. Thank you, Lord. In 
Jesus Christ's mighty name. Amen. And amen. Say, I have wisdom of God. I have wisdom of God. I will never fail. I will not fail. Because God never fails. Because God never fails. In the name of Jesus Christ. In the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. That's it. Amen. Congratulations. Congratulations. The Lord have done it. Amen. The Lord have done it, okay? Amen. The Lord have done it. Congratulations. Amen. I'm happy for your mother also. The Lord have blessed her. Amen. The Lord have blessed her. And uh, the Lord have blessed your family and reunite your family. You speak one language, and that's the one language of love. Amen. Okay? Amen. It's well with you. Amen. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. And a uh, and prayer for your sister. I see a baby girl coming to your sister. Amen. I see a baby girl. I see your, your sister having a baby girl. Amen. I see the girl. The girl is knocking at the door. I don't know why the girl is knocking at the door. The door is supposed to be open for her. Amen. So tell your sister to pray. Tell her to pray. Amen. I see a girl knocking at the door. Amen. You know? A girl knocking at the door. The Lord is going to open the door for, Amen. For, 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 for the girl to come in. And you too. Don't get confused in getting married, eh? Don't get confused. I see, I see the, I see a girl coming this way. I see another girl coming this way. Don't get confused, eh? You must pray before you get into into marriage, eh? Yes. Pray, pray before you get into marriage. Before you get into marriage, bring the picture of the girl. Let's pray, and as we pray, the Lord will do it. Amen. Then when you get in marriage, the marriage will stand. Amen. Then your wife will not disappoint you, and you'll not disappoint your wife. Okay. Amen. Amen. It's very important. Eh? Yes. You are thinking that, but you are, see, you, are, you are looking at two doors. Can I go this way? Can I go this way? Don't worry. God is going to open door, open way for you. So that when you get into the marriage, you are going to be happy. Okay? Amen. Yeah, it is well with you. Good morning. Good morning. God bless you. You are going to travel safely. No problem. Okay?